Welcome to episode eight sixty six. J. Chowdhury, ten lessons. This is an outline of episode eight sixty six. Lesson one to lesson five. This is lesson six to lesson ten. Lesson one: the first mover advantage. J. Chowdhury started his security company, C. Scalar, in two thousand eight. Twelve years later, he is king of cloud security in the world. Right. It's enamored with appliances. You took a very different tact. Explain、mm-hmm. kind of your thinking when you founded the company. So all the companies I had done, I looked for a first mover advantage. So if you are first mover, then you got significant advantage of other others. Lesson two: clean slate architecture. Clean slate means making a fresh start. Suite is so good. Why won't other applications move to the cloud? Answer was yes. So if that's the case, why should security appliances sit in a data center? Security should sit in the cloud as well. So with that simple notion, I said if I start a new company, I had no legacy boxes to worry about. You start with clean slate, clean architecture, design for the cloud. What we like to call born in the cloud for right, the cloud. Right. That's what I did. Lesson three: Security will be a surface in the cloud. Day right? It was just a,、yep. it was it was a BBN, and then we and then enterprise applications. <coughs> What great、right. foresight that you had there! Yeah, so I think we built on the foresight of Salesforce and NetSuite. Right. right.、Uh, but it was obvious that in the new world, security will become a service. Lesson four: Network security will be irrelevant. Security vendors, so-called network security vendors, were protecting the network. They assumed that you sat in an office on the network, right, right. or if you were outside, you came back to the network through a VPN.、Right. We assumed that forget the network. A user sitting in the office or at home or coffee shop airport has to get to some destination over some network. Let's not worry about securing the network. Let's have a policy and security that says whether you are on a PC or a mobile phone, you're simply connecting through our security check post、right. to where you want to go. So mobile and cloud were the natural two things. Mobile became the user,、right. cloud became the destination, and internet became the connector of the two. And we became the policy check post in the middle. Lesson five: the husband and wife team. This is a picture of him and his wife, Jyoti Chowdhury. His wife was an IT professional with an MBA. In 1996, in Atlanta, it was very difficult to find venture capital funding. The couple mortgaged their house and risked everything for their first startup, Secure IT. Lesson six: Learn from customers. Look at 2008. We were going to internet for a whole range of services. Lots of information sitting there, from weather to news and all the other stuff. Right. Now, on cloud applications point of view, Salesforce was doing very well. NetSuite was doing well, and I have been using Salesforce and NetSuite in all of my startups since year 2001. Okay. When each of them was under 10 million in sales. Lesson seven: Ask the right questions. I asked three questions. Will more applications move to the cloud like Salesforce? Answer was yes. Will more information sit on the internet? Answer was yes. Three. Are we going to become more mobile? Answer was yes. If the three yeses, why should your security sit in the data center on prem? It must sit in the cloud, so any user can get to the information safely with a short path, full security. Lesson eight: Ideas a dime a dozen. Yeah, I would say many entrepreneurs get overly excited about lots of ideas. I say ideas are a dime a dozen. Whatever ideas you think is very wonderful and unique, twenty people already thought of it. It's the execution that makes it successful. So focus on flawless, great execution. Lesson nine: Keep on learning. Earn a degree in electronics engineering from IIT. Benares Hindu University. Later on, he earned three master's degree from the University of Cincinnati. 
MBA in marketing, a Master of Science in computer engineering, and then another Master of Science in industrial engineering. He also completed executive management program at Harvard University. In 10, he's a serial entrepreneur. He founded four tech security companies. They were all acquired. Next, how he got rich. His first startup, Secure IT, was sold to VeriSign in 1998 for $70 million. A child said 70 of his employees became millionaires. On his fifth trial, he made it big, and he became the richest overseas Indian billionaire. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.